Hello everyone. Metastructures is a Minecraft Spigot plugin. It allows servers to create new structures which will automatically be placed in any world generation. Metastructures supports air, surface, ocean, underground and deep underground structure generation. Hello, my name is MagnaGuy, the author of Better Structures. Today I will be covering how to install Better Structures, how to install build packs for the plugin and how to find your structures. I will be making another video showing how to create your own content as that takes considerably more time to explain. Better Structures is installed the same way as any other Spigot plugin. You download the file betterstructures.jar from my Spigot page and put it in the plugins folder of your server. Better Structures only has one hard dependency and that is World Edit or Fast Async World Edit. These are the same plugin as far as Better Structures is concerned. This means that the plugin will not run if you don't install either the World Edit or Fast Async World Edit plugins into your server. This is all for installing the plugin, but installing it on its own will not spawn any buildings since you have not downloaded any yet. This leads us to... Now that you install the plugin, you will probably want to see some structures generate. You are able to create your own builds, but if you are looking for a quick way to get hundreds of new structures, you may want to download the build packs that I have on magmaguy.itch.io or patreon.com forward slash magmaguy. About half of the build packs are free and the other half are premium. In total, there are hundreds of new structures that you can explore, with each pack focusing on a specific theme. As an example, the free 103 default structure pack focuses on builds that look like they could be in vanilla Minecraft, whereas the adventure pack focuses on creating challenging vanilla structures with traps and mobs, and the elite packs place mini bosses with custom powers and custom loot through integration with the elite mobs plugin of which I am also the author. Now that you have an idea of what the build packs look like, let's take a look at how to install them. For those of you familiar with my Elite Mobs plugin, this will be a very familiar process. First, you download the build pack from magmaguy.itch.io or patreon.com forward slash magmaguy. This should be a zipped file. Then you place the file, without unzipping it, into the imports folder of Better Structures in the plugins folder of your Minecraft server. Finally, you run the command Better Structures Reload, which automatically unpacks the files and moves them to the correct locations and deletes the zipped files once it is done. And you are done! The builds will now start appearing. Better structures will only generate structures in new chunks. New chunks are chunks that are generating for the first time, and for safety reasons this also applies to chunks that were generated before the plugin was installed. This means that if you are installing the plugin on a server with an existing world, there is no risk of the plugin overwriting any of your existing builds. By default, Better Structures warns server admins when a structure is generated. This is done so admins can verify that the system is working correctly and can be turned off through the command better structure silent or by denying the permission betterstructures.warn. If you are in a server that already had a world, it is recommended that you fly around to places players have not explored yet to see if these structures are generating. Elite Mobs integration is brand new to better structures as of the time of making this video. In case you don't know, Elite Mobs is a boss plugin I created which allows you to create custom items, custom bosses, quests, dungeons, and much, much more. Like Better Structures, there is also a ridiculous amount of both free and premium content which you can download. Elite Mobs structures are different from normal structures in a few ways. For one, they spawn with a boss which will stay in the structure until it is killed, dropping custom loot when it does. In the pre-made packs, these bosses have custom powers that fit the structure they are made for. Additionally, the Elite Mobs integration also recommends you use the World Guard plugin. This is because if World Guard is installed, the region the boss spawns in will be protected until the boss is killed, creating a fair combat arena that can only be exploited once the boss is dead. Finally, if you uninstall Better Structures, the regions that Better Structures created through World Guard cease to be protected, meaning you won't accidentally find yourself having to delete potentially thousands of protected regions. While I try to keep better structures well optimized, the plugin needs to do a lot of things to make sure that it is generating structures as well as it possibly can. As such, it is possible that you will see some performance issues when using this plugin. The good news is that there are several ways of minimizing the impact of better structures on your server, including a way to 100% get rid of all the performance impact. The first way of optimizing the performance is to use fast async world edit instead of world edit. It can be considerably faster depending on your setup. The second optimization is double checking if you are using a good view distance on your server. This is the one set in server.properties. The more chunks get loaded on the server, the more structures need to be placed by better structures and the slower the entire server runs. 
The third optimization is dedicating more RAM if you are using less than 3 gigabytes. You will not see a performance boost above 4 to 5 gigabytes, and it is usually never recommended that you dedicate more than 10 gigabytes of RAM to a server. The fourth optimization is the ultimate solution and completely gets rid of all the performance impact, and that is to pre generate your world. A plugin like Chunky allows you to spend a few hours generating an entire world, and once that is done, better structures will not have to place any structures down. Unless you are using elite structures, which require better structures to make sure that the protections are working, better structures won't do anything and therefore won't have any impact on performance. The only downside of pre-generating your world is that you will be unable to add new buildings to existing regions later on if you make them, or if more packs come out that you would like to use. Some people use world borders and world trimming to get around this issue, or make exploration-only worlds that get reset when new content comes out. This is up to you to decide. And that's it! That's all you need to know to install better structures. I will be making another video covering how to create your own content, and that will probably be a bit longer than this video. I would like to thank all of the Patreon supporters which make the development of these plugins possible, and if you like this video or like my plugin, consider leaving a rating on Spigots and maybe subscribing to my channel. I'll be starting to make more videos now, focusing on more development stuff. But that's it for now, I'll see you in the next one.